CrowdStrike, CRWD is a ticker. It's a 42 billion market cap company, currently trading around about $176.70. On the Q2 FY 2024 earnings call, Krauslake's management expects top line growth in the second half of 2023 to increase. Krauslake is more, now more competitive in the securities market business due to the quick update of new product lines. Krauslake's new operational objective model suggests margins are set to improve with increased long-term free cash flow margins. Important to keep an eye on the competition, in particular Microsoft. Over the past 12 months, the stock is down 2.8%, year-to-date up 68%. The forward PE is negative, the current PE ratio is negative, the price-to-book ratio is 16.8 times, the price-to-sale ratio of 10.4 times, and the price-to-cash flow of 26.5. Naturally, the PE peg ratio is negative. Let's go to FinScreener and take a look. Okay, so here we're inside a fin screener and looking at CrowdStrike. So as we can see, the graph has been on a bit of a run over the past couple of months. Bit of weakness in August with, along with the overall equity market, but still the stock has been doing quite well. Okay, so let's take a look at the valuation parameters. You know, the stock really has, it's not valued at this point in time on a PE ratio and a forward PE ratio, losses for this year and losses into next year. But on the recent earnings call, the bosses at CrowdStrike did expect sales to increase in the second half of this year. All depends on a bit on the competition. So you can see on the price of book and the price of sales ratio, this is not a cheap stock. Okay, so if we go down, what we're really looking at is sales growth going forward. Okay, and as we can see over the past five years, you know, sales growth has really grown, but it's come out from really nothing. So we've got to look forward if sales growth is going to reflect on the overall company and do well. So that's CrowdStrike. Let's go over to the next one.